Jesus Christ is the Lord. He is Lord. He is Lord. Amen. He has risen from the dead. He is Lord. Can we just pray in the spirit? Can we pray in the spirit in this place? Come, boy, 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 Of 
to say. Your name is to be our Lord. Adonai, from the rising of the sun to the setting of the sun, your name is to be our Because I have seen your wedding gown, you are being clothed with your wedding gown. And I say, I am lucky at the fire, Valencia. I am a fire at the fire. I told you it does not come alone. One of his angels is clothing. That one, that one, that one, that one, that one. I am a baby at the fire. Can you lift up your hand in this place and scream, I receive it at the count of three. I see the wedding gown is so beautiful. The count of three, you are going to shout and receive it. And then you are going to pray in the spirit like never before. One, two, three, shout. Can we pray in this place? Can we pray in this place? Man de scapon de l'escaboy. Aya ba 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 ba. Oh, we are not praying, oh, we are not praying, oh. Embra ba 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 caparia de caparate. Ja ba 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 ba. We are not praying, we are not praying, we are not praying. Father, thank you, Father. Akbar Alonuko, Akbar Alonuko, oh, la no, sorry, you oh, what is there? Akbar Alonuko, Akbar. Hallelujah. Can we all move forward? Yeah, let's occupy the seat so that people who are coming in can go to the back. Let's do that quickly. Don't be... Please help me control this feedback. You can move the one from the drums. Please control the feedback. God bless you. Hallelujah. It's still feeding back. Hallelujah. Probably put off some of the mics. Put it off, put it off. If you are not using it now, just put it off. You can leave the one, the two mics here are needed. Hallelujah. Okay, that's the one. Uh, my voice has changed. I think it's in 
разлог. Hallelujah. Just bring down whatever you need to bring down. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Somebody ready to pray. Now we are going to spend a few minutes to pray tonight. And I know that you are not going home the way you came. I expect a bigger amen. amen. I said you are not going the way you came. I said, you are not going the way you came. Amen. Isaiah, please be looking outside once in a while so that I can help people with parking. Right? You are not going the way you came. Amen. Somebody say a convincing amen. amen. I am repeating again, you are not going the way you came. Amen. The Lord assured me strongly that there are, there are at least seven people that will enter this place tonight. He said he's doing a total turnaround of their life. Total turnaround. There is a total shift. You, you, are, not, you are not looking forward to it, that particular kind of shift. The Lord is just going to move you from where you are now to where you never thought you would be in life. That's what is going to happen to you. So when it's time to pray, I beg you in the name of the Lord to pray. Because see, something is going to happen to someone here tonight that will make all of us say we know you before. Hallelujah. Uh, maybe I'm the one that owns that anyway. Uh, people will say, uh, is it not Pastor Yomi? I know you now. Uh -uh. <laughs> I used to come to Zion tribe that time. Somebody ready? Somebody ready? Now lift up your both hands and just say thank you to the Lord. Go ahead. We are here to pray. Go ahead and say thank you, Jesus. 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 Shada baradike la balate biadora dabayante. Father, we give you praise. 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 Shampata la baragadia. Marada bele vele te kosota baradia. Thank you, Jesus. Let him hear your voice. 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 There is a need for him to hear you. There's a need for him to hear you. Somebody be intentional about the worship of this evening. Tell Jesus, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Rakata bada bada bada. Etele bondo koparo de biata. Somebody say thank you, 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 say thank you. Shata bata kapata, mara kapala tabakata. Say thank you, Jesus. 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 Those who are online, oh, those of us inside here, go ahead and say thank you, Lord Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Bible say unto you all flesh shall come 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 thank you Jesus sakapata radabaradia epete kete ketai and sambrantala baladabaya thank you father Jesus precious name we have prayed. Amen. Second Kings chapter 2 verse 19. And the men of the city said unto Elijah, Behold, I pray thee, the situation of this city is pleasant. Look at every one of us, beautiful people. Beautiful people, handsome people. He said, As my Lord see it, we can see it. He said, But the water is not. There is a problem somewhere. That's what God brought you here for tonight. I mean, you have all kinds of reason to not be here tonight. But the Bible says that, I mean, he said there is, the water is not. Now, let me tell you, there's a song we used to sing back then in the days in Yoruba that says that you born come be la ye mi. E mi ko fe mo la to ni lo. 
Oba to wo shugbon jabesi wo shugbon aye mi now there is it may be something so tiny so little but it may be disturbing your life to a point where people will look at you and say ah, ah when we thought by now things should have happened for you things should have turned around for you your life should have been transformed things should have been better than this how come you are still at this level after all these years of praying and trusting and fighting how come things have not moved to the way to the point where the lord wanted it to move hallelujah somebody is going to pray tonight and those things will turn yes they will turn somebody hearing me I said they will turn I'm saying they will turn I said they will turn I said they will turn I say again they will turn I say again they will turn I say again they will turn a testimony came this morning I'm sure daddy will be watching online a pastor and his family that worship with us on ignition every day many of you will remember this morning I was praying for a particular person I was saying Johnny Messis. How many remember? I was saying Johnny Messis. Shortly after ignition, a call came. The visa they've been waiting for for a very long time. Good news came. Immediately after ignition. I, I just, I, I mean, we were praying. I was praying for family, calling their names. And it got to his turn. And then I began to say, Johnny Messis. Johnny Messis. I don't even know what I'm talking. I'm, I mean, sometimes the prophetic can be that funny. You don't know what you're saying. Just say it. And I just kept saying Johnny Messis. Daddy called, in fact, his message. He sent a message first, and then he now called. Now, there is his message again. He said, Daddy, good morning, sir. Rejoice with me. My testimony had arrived, sir. My visa had arrived. A big thanks to the Lord of Ignition. This is 10, 15 a.m. Somebody is going to pray tonight. The Lord God of Ignition will turn it around for you. Somebody believe God here. The Lord God of Ignition is turning it around for you. I said he's turning it around for you. Somebody will shout and say, Father, you can do better than that. Shout, Father. Father, visit my foundation tonight. Visit my foundation. My Lord and my God, visit my foundation tonight. Visit my foundation tonight in the name of Jesus. Visit my foundation tonight. Aba 
we have prayed. Like you have the strength by the spirit to help remove a stumbling block from someone. Eh? Go and find someone. What you want to do is to help the person remove a stumbling block. Eh? Let it be that whoever you are going to pray with now have stamina. Shakata kata kata. And now when I'm saying stamina, I'm not talking about physical stamina. I'm talking about spiritual stamina. To help push off whatever is blocking your way. Certain things has to be pushed out. Man of God, certain things has to be pushed out. We have been held in one corner for too long. We have been held in one corner for too long. We have been held in one corner for too long. Paul said, I will have come to you. He said, we will have come to you. He said, but Satan hindered us. Satan and hindered us. Somebody you pray and pray for the person you are holding and say, I push off every hindrance, stomping block. I push off. I push away every hindrance, stomping block, stomping block, resistance. I push them away now. I push them away now. Somebody open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name, we are prayed. Lazarus, come forth. But somebody has to roll away the stone. I don't care if the voice that is calling you forth is stronger than the loudest noise in the whole world. Somebody must roll away the stone. Look at that person straight in their eyes and say the stone shall be rolled away. Somebody say it like you are convinced. There is no rocket science about this. Faith calls forth those things that be not as though look at that person again and say that stone shall be rolled away. Alright, can you turn to someone someone fresh and say that stone shall be rolled away. Look at the third set of people and say that stone shall be rolled away. That stone, sir, shall be rolled away. That stone shall be rolled away. I want you to speak convincingly. That stone shall be rolled away. I said that stone shall be rolled away. I said that stone shall be rolled away. I said that stone shall be rolled away. I want you to help me pray for a fresh person. Fresh person. This is what you are going to say. Where are the angels? Say it after me. Say where are the angels? That rolled, rolled away. The stones. The stones. And the tomb of Jesus. At the tomb of Jesus. Do, do you understand now? Do you understand? Do you understand? Do you understand? Where are the angels?
Thank you, Father. For you to further confirm that the devil was put to shame. When they finished rolling away the stone, what did they do? It's to let you know that we are too small. There is a song that said the stone that could not hold him. Uh -huh. uh, no, not that one. There's one that said, that's good, no holding. What a powerful name it is. What a powerful name it is. The name of Jesus Christ. What a powerful name it is. Nothing compares to me. What a powerful name it is. The name of Jesus. Say it again. What a powerful name it is. Ay, ay, ay. You are going to act like a man on assignment and a woman on assignment. You just go and look around. Eh? Look around this place. Go and find someone. Go and find someone. Go and find. You want to partner with those angels. Go and find someone. Uh, probably somebody you don't know before. Yes. Oh, my damsel. Go and look for someone you don't know. You, you are going to see. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. Something is about now something is about to happen someone's chain will suddenly break someone's chain will suddenly break i said someone's chain is about to break 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 your chain is about to break that 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 chain is about you are going to partner with this, those two angels. And you will, you will roll the stone. You know what you are going to do? Eh? I move the stone away. As you say, you, 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 see, see, that stone will practically be rolled out of the way. You are going to speak and say, I roll the stone away. Listen, listen, listen. For some of us, that stone represents your financial destiny. They have put it there for long. No matter what you do, it's just looking like you're still begging. No matter the kind of intelligence and, and the systems you put around business, that business just does not grow. Devil is a bad devil. The part of the just indeed is as a shiny light, sir. And the Bible says it shines more. The word more means that it will shine far, far better than yesterday. Then tomorrow, far better. Then next tomorrow, far better. If it is the same thing you saw tomorrow or yesterday that you are seeing today, and then you see tomorrow, there is a, there's something wrong somewhere. Some of us, they can describe us by the clothes we wear. They know it's that color blue clothes, Jesse from Chelsea. Because they have seen it for two years. Don't feel bad. I was like that. I mean, you don't need any other way to describe me. It's the best shirt. The only shirt. The, the most funniest shirt in the whole world. I will wash in the night. I will bring it out in the morning. Chelsea shirt. I love Chelsea in those days. Until I could not wash football again. But even Chelsea will know 
Number one, the shirt is not even original in the first place. Eh? Only to now wear the shirt to the point where the blue. The blue now, I don't know the color means to again. Eh? It turns to see. <laughs> so don't, I mean, I don't even care. The, tomorrow, I'm still going to wear it. Let me tell you. That story is changing now. Amen. That story is changing now. Amen. There are some things that they have used in describing you. It, two years ago, if you want to describe me, you don't need too many explanations. When you just see me walk past you, you just have a description. It has changed. God can indeed change the story of man. I say God can indeed change the story of man. Are you going to partner by faith this evening? And say I roll it out of the way. I want you to speak to the destiny of that man. Yes. I, 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 see, see. Don't pray like one who don't have faith. Don't pray like one who don't have faith. Don't pray like one. I want you to speak to the destiny of that man. And say, I roll the stone away. 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 Somebody open your mouth and pray. Precious name we are praying. Now, the children of Israel were going to pass by a certain place. And then they got there to discover that the wall is thicker than any building you can ever find in the whole world. And then they were stopped. Now, the problem with our generation is that we will have given up. Do you know what the wall of Jericho is? That's a wall that it will take only God. Only God can fall the wall of Jericho. In fact, it would have been stupid for the people that built the wall of Jericho to speak the way the guy that built Titanic spoke. You remember the guy that broke, built Titanic? He said even God cannot sink Titanic. That's the worst what was the uh, ship accident that ever happened in all time? The number of people that died on Titanic, they are still saying today that what we have is an esti est estimated number. Thousands of people died because one person dared to doubt God. When you see people online today saying that there is no God, just leave them. That's why you see a lot of mad people on the road. The wrath of God is something not to touch. You have to be careful. Yoruba people will say that uh, when a dog runs mad, he will recognize the, the owner. Eh? Yes, sir. You want
want to come and fight somebody's God? Even if you don't believe God, can't shut up your mouth? Eh? When you see their hand, you already know they did something. There are people you don't confront. It's true. People of God, don't say uh, uh, all, the, all your men of God that are untouchable. Some are untouchable. You have not been to where they went to. You were not there. How many nights they confronted the devil? You better be careful. If you want to speak to people, be, be sure that they are empty. Don't go and speak to a band that carries fire. And then the children of Israel got to Jericho. Only for God not to use weapon. He said, shout. How can a shout bring down a wall? We are going to shout fire seven times. We will, we, we will be rounding up soon. We are going to shout fire seven times. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. I don't know the day we were praying. Was it Thursday or Wednesday? We were praying in the night. And then I asked people to shout fire. A sister just said she began to shout fire. And she could not stop. And she could not stop. Let me tell you what happened to her. I'm, I mean, I'm talking about somebody who is not married. A menstrual period has been seized for six solid years. Fire! 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 And she felt something around her body. That's how that well broke. Every good thing that the enemy has stopped in your life. You better say better, amen. Telegram, say better, amen. Mixeller, say better, amen to this prayer. Those of us on Facebook, you must scream a better, amen. Every good thing that the enemy has stopped in your life, as I pray here, in the name of the Lord God of hosts, I put it back to war. Jesus came back to life. It, I, I don't care. It will have stayed dead. But Jesus came back. After three days, he rose from the dead. Everything that is dead in your life, put your, lay your right hand on your head. I command them, back to life. In the name of Jesus that died and rose again. I don't care how long he's been dead. I don't care what the doctor says about it. It's possible the doctors will have told you that don't bother. I mean, you know, it's, it's medication for life. Shakata katai. Agbar alarumpa. Ola na sori okum. Oh, the Jericho, Agbara Olorunpo, Agbara Olorunpo, Ola no sori okun. Oh, the Jericho, Agbara Olorunpo, Agbara Olorunpo, Ola no sori okun. Oh, the Jericho.
organ in your body. Online and on site. Every organ in your body that is no longer functioning properly. I command it to come back to life. 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 That kidney, come back to life. That blood pressure, come back to normal. Liver, come back to life. Liver, come back to life. Whatever they have declared dead in your body, I command it back to life. You are going to pray. We are still going to roll away the stone. You are still going to roll away the stone. The angels that roll away the stone by the tomb of Jesus. Those angels, I don't even understand. It was, it was so obvious that they were angry. When we get to heaven, I want to know their names. They roll away the stone and they say, men and they come. You don't understand? You will meet us here. I mean, this is not a situation of let's just, just roll it away. I mean, they have the power to carry the stone and disappear. You know, gravity does not affect them. Gravity doesn't affect them. Weight does not affect them. They could carry the, they could, uh, they could make the, the stone to, to uh, probably lose weight or disappear. But they sat on it to say we are we are bigger than your problems. We are bigger than your mountains. Bigger than uh, my troubles. Bigger than God is bigger than earth. Oh, he's bigger than all my problems. God is bigger than every mountain. They sat on it. I'm sending that those angels to the house of everyone under the sound of my voice. They are going now. They are, they are going to your family house. They are, they are going to your place of business. Aha. Matthew, please come. They are going to your place of business. Some of you, they are visiting your school. Some of you, they are visiting organization where you have, where you have applied for something and they refuse to answer you. Some of us, they are visiting your office. Some offices, they have refused to grant you promotion. Some of them, whatever represents that stumbling block, you will say your amen three times. In the name of Jesus, they roll it away now. Now, we want to shout fire seven times. Let me tell you, I, I don't know. They see, I think that sister is even a new person. When I saw, when I saw her testimony, I had to put a call. I said, are you sure of what you're saying? She said, yes. She said, I mean, she's, she's on. Ladies, you understand what I'm talking, talking about? She said, she's on. Six years. She, six years. Uh, she said the last time she remembered that she ever had it was six years ago. So she can't even put months together. That's how bad the devil is. Some of you have not shared a, as much as a single meaningful, reasonable testimony in the past four, five, three, three seven years, two years. Is that how wicked God is? No. Our God is a good God. And he doeth good even to you at all times. But there is a boy called Prince of Persia. We will not let people rise. He does not like seeing people rise. Yes, and today he's going to be defeated. Somebody say, somebody say it will be, it will be defeated. I want us to pray. The two pastors here, when you shout the first fire, they will release a word of prophecy to bring down the wall of Jericho. 
you shout the second fire. Another wall of prophecy will come. That everything called Jericho, your life comes down. Then you will say the shout of fire the third time. Another word will come. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. You see these five days of prayer has been one of the time. In fact, this year has been very amazing. I think all our programs this year have been filled with testimonies. Strange, strange testimonies. Strange testimonies. I, 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 was, I was trying to sleep. Then somebody started calling my phone. So I put the phone, you know, when I want to sleep, so that I will live long. Sometimes I'll just put the phone in flight mode. But this person, it was like the person waited by the phone. At the phone. The moment I remember that I was supposed to call somebody, I think it was Matthew. The moment I remembered and I removed the flight mode, his call came in. Ah, you are long. So at that point, I picked. He said, Sir, I know you will pick. I said, he said, I made up my mind that I will call you today. <laughs> so sometimes it, people try like that, but there will be no time. Now, he, I picked the call and he began to say, I don't know what's happening to me, sir. I don't know what's happening to me. I'm getting calls from customs. I'm getting calls from customs. I said, what happened? He said, my goods were part of the goods that were seized early this year. And it was counted as part of goods that they said were, I don't know the name he called it. Yes. He said, but I know mine is not contraband. They have, I have all the papers I'm supposed to have, and yet they still seized my gold. He said, I just kept getting calls this morning. Are you Mr. Soso? Are you Mr. Soso? It's like, uh, we are releasing your goods today. We are releasing. He was in a hurry to call me. I mean, you don't understand. He shows that he's in a hurry, running somewhere, and he just wants to make sure he will call till I pick. He said, uh, sir, let them release it all. <laughs> He said, this one that they have called me. He said, let them release you. He said, all the time I've gone to their office, they have been sending me out of their office. They don't want to see me. He said, but I know my goods are not in bad goods. He said, but they, 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 are, they are saying I should come, I should come. When those words come out now, it will address your case. I don't know. Is there, is there anything outside? Are we called? I said, to address your case. I want your energy level to go higher. I say to address your case. I say to address your case. Are you seeing your case now? Eh? I say to address your case. So that the Egyptians you are seeing today, you will see it no more forever. The Egyptians you are seeing now, you will see it no more forever. It will address your case. Somebody ready now? I want you to shout fire. fire. Speak a word. There's somebody under the sound of my voice. There's somebody under the sound of my voice. Uh, this is what I'm seeing. I'm, I'm just going to explain what I'm seeing. I, I, I'm seeing that the same clothes that you have always worn, that has looked so beautiful, so fitted on you, just suddenly became so big. You don't understand? It just suddenly became so big. It means that there is something in and around your life that has shrunk. Yes, the devil has shrunk certain things around your life. Something that used to be so much has become so small it has become so so lean whatever they have taken from you take it from your body take it from your business take it from your career take it back now Whatsoever has defied medical logic, whatsoever has defied spiritual logic, today they die. 
There are two people under the sound of my voice. You are walking, but it's not, it does not make any sense. Uh, yes. How would you have walked for the number of years you have walked? Eh? And it's looking like you are not making anything out of it. Eh, you are still looking like one who is looking for a job. Even though you wake up and go out every day. I pray for you now. I pray for you now. The Lord God of Iglesian. The Lord God of victory. The Lord God of Zion. Is fixing you on a better job now. It's fixing you on a better job now. It's fixing you on a better job now. Somebody shout fire. I am challenging the mountain of finance right now. And I say every mountain that has obstructed you, it at all, uh, that has obstructed your finances from growing. I am saying this mountain knows my voice. There's somebody under the sound of my voice. The Lord is returning your inheritance. Uh, your inheritance. The Lord is returning your inheritance. I, I believe God. Believe God. I said the Lord is returning your inheritance. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. There's someone online. There's someone online. You are, you are saying since you moved to Lagos, there's been a problem. It, it looks like you, you started diving from the moment you moved to Lagos. And the Lord said I should give you dominion over the atmosphere of Lagos. Wherever you may be, as you see me now, as you see me now, I place upon you the power, the power to take dominion over the city, over the city of Lagos. I give to you now power. Receive it now. 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 Somebody shout fire. I decree and I declare. I speak under the mantle of the heavenly God. Whatsoever represents stagnancy in your life. Whatsoever represents backwardness in your life. Whatsoever represents weeping in your life, whatsoever represents sorrow in your life, whatsoever represents retrogression in your life, this evening the power of the Almighty God rolls it away, rolls it away, he rolls it away, amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Before we shout the rest of the two fire, if you know you need the supernatural touch of God and you need it fast, come and stand here. Come and stand here. For healing, for breakthrough, for deliverance, for whatsoever, you know that you need strange healing power of God. You need the touch of God. Are you ready? Are you ready? 
You see, you see, this is the portal that I talked about. This is the portal that I talked about. Seven miracles will happen to people that are here under the sound of my voice. You must speak one of it. You must speak one of it. The first one is the miracle of speed. Yes, the first one is the miracle of speed. There is somebody under the sound of my voice in front here. Strange, strange order of speed. Strange order of speed. Strange order of speed is coming upon you. Strange order of speed speed strange order of speed strange order of speed strange order of speed i am seeing that speed i'm seeing that speed i'm seeing that speed i'm seeing that speed the hand of the lord is resting upon someone here the fire of the holy ghost is resting upon someone here for speed for speed lift up your hands lift up your hands whoever owns or is the owner of this first miracle take it now 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 20 years will look like just two months. You don't understand? God is collapsing time for that man. God is collapsing time for you. The Lord 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 God is collapsing time for you. Number two miracle that is going to happen to people in front of me here is a strange order of healing. A strange order of healing. Now, there is, uh, turn it down a little bit, my brother. There is an order of healing that comes and you do get healed gradually. The Lord has answered your prayer, but you get healed, you know, gradually. There is another order of healing that it's instant. Yes, it's instant. There is a third order of healing. The Lord will say, no, 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 no. I don't want to repair the one that is there. It's called creative, creative miracle. Uh, uh, the Lord is going to put a new one in your body. Whichever one your destiny requires, or whichever one your body requires, in the name of Yeshua Kamashiaka, take it now. Take it now. Take was speaking the other time. He was talking about the miracle of finance. Somebody here. Now, I, I have to dis make this one singular because that's what I'm seeing right now. Somebody here. Somebody here. You are entering. You see this, your leg is about to enter a place where you will not, money will not be able to stop coming. Yes. I mean, per seconds, per seconds, per seconds, per seconds, per seconds, per seconds. Your leg is about to enter a particular spot where money never finishes. Where money never finishes. Your feet is about to enter a particular spot where money never finishes. Receive it now. Receive it now. Receive it now. Somebody shout fire. I am speaking against every demon sitting on your testimonies. Jesus. 
Jesus. Number four. There is a, a family here. Not all of you are represented here. Only that you represent them. And the fire is going to spread from here. You see, the Lord wants me to know that the stubborn enemy of that family is about to be buried. The stubborn enemy of your family. The stubborn enemy, your stubborn pursuer, your stubborn pursuer is about to be buried. I decree they must be buried. They are buried. Number five, right? Number five. Number five. I don't know who this is, but I'm claiming it already. I'm claiming it, and I want all of you to join me by faith to receive it for me. Yes, join me and receive it for me. Fame, oh, fame, 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 sweatless fame. Yes, sweatless fame. Yada katalate katai. Sweatless, sweatless. You don't have to do anything. No publicity. No publicity. Yes, no ads. The Lord is just going to give you popularity. Cheap, cheap one, cheap one. It's a divine setup from the throne of God. It's a divine setup. I don't know who this is, but I trust the Lord that it is me first of all and any other person that wants this I decree and declare receive that fame now receive it now receive it now the Bible talk about how that the fame of Jesus was noised abroad is already famous but there, there are now agents that are noising it abroad they are taking it from Lagos to Quatznovo to to we are again no 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 we won't stop in Africa they will enter Egypt they will enter Kenya maybe when they enter Kenya the crisis in Kenya will stop they will enter South Africa and then they will cross to Italy they will go to London they will go to America somebody here together with myself we are entering our season of fame we are entering our season of faith. Let me tell you what this means for a business person under the sound of my voice. You see that product? Eh? It will just begin to gain popularity. Somebody, do you understand me? Do you understand me? It means if it is pencil you are selling. I, I went to somebody's place of, of business to pray for them. And I said, sir. I said, everything you have here, you are, you are important. He said, yes. I said, what can you make? I don't know why I'm say, I was saying that to him. I said, what can you create? What that you can, you can produce? And he said, ah, sir, uh, some couple of years ago, myself and some China people, we were taught a partner to uh, create a particular, and he began to explain it's something medical, something, you know, you can use in the hospital and you know, in other places. And then I said, so why did you stop? Why did you stop? He said, sir, I don't just know why. I just got tired. Ah, I said, ah, ah, you are the one that is delaying us. Ah, by now that I enter your shop like this, I will have gone home with a brand new car. Because you will have been that wealthy. That small thing will have taken your name all over the world. A day is coming. I'm going to share his testimony that all of you will see. Between February and now, they created that thing. They sent the first batch to Nigeria. Within one week, they sold off. Uh, they went back and said, do times five of what you did now. They brought it Nigeria. Uh, on the way, on the way, they sold off the thing has not arrived. People bought off everything. The prophetic is in this strange. Somebody is under the sound of my voice here. If you can stretch forth your hands toward me, something is going to come into your hand that will be far popular than Coca-Cola. I say again, something is going to hit your hand. A brand, a product, a product is going to come out of your hand. It will be far popular than in the name of Jesus Christ, this your hand.
man will carry something that will be far more popular than everything that you have ever seen in the name of Jesus Christ. Listen, you better believe in faith. Bring your hand, my brother. You are blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. You better believe. Eh? Sometimes, eh? It is your products that announce your name. How many believe? Apple announced the name of Steve Jobs. He's dead. He's still popular. Eh? Apple. Apple. Eh? Something must announce your name this year. All right. Can you point your hand to me? And say, Pion, something must announce your name this year. I love those of you that love me. God bless you. Ah, people love me here. People love me here. All right, say again. Say, you're me as Zan. Something in your hand. Whether it is there now. Or it's coming to your hand from today. It's going to announce your name. All over the world. They will get to know you. And celebrate you. And celebrate you. Somebody shout fire! Jesus! 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 Jesus, ah, Jesus, 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 Jesus. Pastor, I'm here, I've been hearing something very clearly, something very clearly, sir. Sir, the Lord has been speaking to me about you since. Pastor, I don't know this man from anywhere. But I hear the Lord saying clearly to me. He's been speaking since. And he says, I tell you, sir, that no longer shall it be said about your life that the glory of the past is greater than the present. I don't know what it is or where you have operated in the, in the past. But your present is worse than the past. But the Lord says he's revisiting you afresh. And he is bringing something new into your life. He says, son, do not think about the things you have lost. He says, behold, I do something new for you. He says, for your age is immaterial before my eyes. Because I will still do it. 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 Le Kapaya in the name of Jesus. Shekatolia Marikaro Satayan the Kapai. My God, my God, my God, my God. Life breaks your son. 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 In the name of Jesus. Pastor Mike, have we told you anything about daddy? That's too accurate. That is, that is too accurate. Oh, 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 oh. he say, oh. say it to me. to hear you again. Yeah. 
what we need to do quickly here and we close. Um, please help us bring the communion now. Sheung, I need the bottle of oil here quickly, quickly, quickly. Quickly. Now, let me announce this. Some strange things are happening among us. They are strange because you will not expect a ministry at our level to have this level of answers to prayers. I mean, you would look at our size and all and you may think but the level of answers to prayer that we are experiencing is amazing. And I know that this is for everyone. I'm telling you. It's for everyone. The Bible says that the promise is for us. It's to us and to our children's children. So, so now, this is what I want to say to everyone that has stepped into this place tonight. Within the next seven days, you will be the next person sharing testimony. Amen. All right, let me say, let me, I want to say to myself first, and then I'll generalize it to everybody, so that it will not look like I, I'm not here. Eh? Within the next seven days, your me Azan will share the biggest testimony. All right, now let me generalize it now. Are you going to say amen? Within the next one week, every one of us standing right in front of me here, you will share the loudest, the biggest, the strongest testimony in the name of Jesus. Listen to me. Listen. Listen. If you know what just happened between that prophecy that just happened between Pastor Mike and Daddy now, you will know that there is God in this place. Myself, Pastor Anu, and she visited daddy. But they don't know details. So there is no way anybody in this place will have known what Pastor Mike said about daddy. So let me tell every one of you that has come here tonight. See, you can remove your shoe and put your feet on this floor. Because you are not going home empty. Oh. Please listen to me clearly. You are not going empty. You are not going empty. I'm telling you now. Something, something powerful is following you home. So I'm telling you, even you now, you have become, you have become a conduit. Eh? You have become a conduit of possibility. Everyone around you will begin to, they will, they will begin to have positive happenings from tonight. Yes, they will begin to have positive happenings from tonight. You have become an atmosphere of God. Somebody hearing me, you have become an atmosphere of God. Amen. You know the Bible talked about how that people will come to Nayot just to come and see Samuel and they will begin to prophesy. And, and it doesn't matter whether you love God, you know God, you hate God, you hate people of God, you hate Samuel, you are coming to kill him, you are coming to love him, you are bringing gifts to him, you want to come and steal from him. When you enter Nayot, you prophesy. Uh, so, so can you take a little of the grace that God has placed upon this ministry tonight? Every one of you that has come, this is a take home for you. In the name of Yeshua Kamashiaka, the prophetic grace upon this house. Ayakate Katai. I don't know whether there are two people who want to take it. Who can I have people? Two people who want to take it. The prophetic grace upon this house. Take it now. 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 Be silent. Be silent. Be silent. Just be silent. Be silent. There, there, there's um, a message the Lord took, gave me in the month of March. I, I saw some things falling from my body. And when they fall from my body, like a gold, like, you know, uh, what do they call this gold that is store? This gold that is store in gold reserve. That's that thing. Gold bars. <laughs> like gold bars. It was falling out of my body. And they were beautiful, you know, they were falling out of my body. They were falling out of my body. And the Lord told me and he said, he said, this will represent two things this year in your ministry. He said, I will bring out of you seer prophets that are far 
greater than you. He said to me, he said, I'm going to bring them out of you. He said, they will be greater than you. He said, but I'm bringing them out of you. Number two, he said, from out of you, I will raise men who will raise a generation of people who will never lack. Did you hear what I just said? He said, I'm raising men that will raise a generation of people who will never lack. Do you understand what I mean by that? It means that billionaires have been born out of the loins of our grace. Billionaires have been born out of the loins of our grace. I'm praying for those who want to receive the seer of prophetic grace. And you want it sincerely. You are ready to serve God with your life. You are ready to be consecrated to him. In the name of Yeshua Kamashia, take it now. Take it. Take it, 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 If you are too full of pride, you better leave ministry alone. It's not for proud people. You don't want anybody to be greater than you. You are joking. A great man must raise another greater man. If no, somebody who is greater than you can't come out of your loins, you have wasted the God's time. You've wasted the resources. You've wasted the divine resources. You are going home from here, a greater person. I say, I'm waiting for your testimony. Believe me now, believe me. Do you believe me? How many believe me? I said, you are going to call me. But brother, you are going to call me and give me testimonies. I see breakthrough coming for you. Yes, I see breakthrough coming for you. They are not going to die. They will, they will watch you rejoice. My brother, listen to me clearly. They, you, they don't need to die. Your enemies need to see you alive and see that you are doing well. Believe what I say now. They will not die. I won't let, see, I don't pray for them to die. Because they have written you up. If they see you die, eh, they will not see what you become. For you, they will see. They will open their eyes and see what you are becoming. Yes, eh, they will see what you are becoming. And listen to me. It's beginning this year. It is beginning this year. It is beginning this year. This is what I'm seeing. Like a man with four legs. Four legs. And all the four legs are in three different I mean, four different gigantic buildings. And this is what it means. It says to me, it said, conglomerate will be born out of you. Conglomerate, 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 conglomerate. The group of company of this, uh, group of company of that, group of company of this, uh, group of company of that. Receive it now. Where's the communion first? Where's the communion? Father, will it believe that you came, you died, you rose again, and you are now with the Father, and you will return once again to take us home with you. This is according to your commandment, that we should do this in remembrance of you. I anoint this communion element in the name of God the Father Amen. and God the Son Amen. and God the Holy Spirit. Amen. This will begin the exodus, exodus of everyone in this place tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. As you take this Passover, you are leaving Egypt. Amen. As you take this Passover, you are walking out of Egypt. Amen. And as you take this Passover, you will not live empty. You won't live empty and dead. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Now, we will share this and we will take it together. There's no time. I want us to be on our way home. Let us share. Let us share, everyone. Make sure you take. Make sure you take. You can only take one. All right? Uh, you can only take one. The Lord bless you. Hallelujah. Now, now, once you have your home, eh, we are going to lift it up together. 
and we are going to pray. Now, this is what you are going to do. This is what you are going to do quickly. Eh? You are going to just tell the Lord, whatever cannot be found in Jesus, as I take this, I command them to leave me alone. I, I, are you getting me? I command them to do what? As I take this, I command them to leave me alone. Bible says that strangers shall be afraid. It says they will run out of their secret places. As I take this, they do what? They leave me alone. All right. So, are, do you all have it? Do we all have it? All right. Please, let's be fast. Let's be fast. Let's be fast. Pastor, well, no, please take the oil and prepare it. Everybody's just going to touch the oil and then we'll be on our way home. There are fruits. I'm going to pray for those who supplied fruits and water. The Lord bless all of you. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord God of this commission bless you. In the name of Jesus, we don't take for granted this goodwill that has come from you. We do not take it for granted. We don't take it for granted. God bless you. God bless you. We are still going to pray for you later. Are we ready? Do we all have the communion element now? Please, uh, those who are serving, please make sure that you are participating. You must be participating. I'm going to watch you two rise in life. Yes, yes, you are going to rise in life. Nobody is going to serve in this ministry and, and end up badly. Yes, you are going to rise in life too. You are going to rise in life too. All the volunteers, all the staffs, you are going to rise too. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You are going to thrive. Even in this season, you will thrive. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lift it up. Do you remember what I told you to say? Whatever cannot be found that is currently, what do you say to it? Are you ready? In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Now say your prayer on it. Say your prayer on it. Shata kapara da baladia. Whatever cannot be found in Jesus. That is currently operating in my life. Physically, spiritually. Ministerially. In my family. Over my children. Over my family. Whatever cannot be found in Jesus. That is currently resident in our lives. I command you to live now. 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 Thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name we pray. The Bible said the night that Jesus was crucified, the Bible said he took the bread and he broke it. Can I open this one now? Let's open this one. Which one did you take? Without taking it out. The Bible said he took the bread and he broke it. And he said, this is my body. That it is broken for you. That's why you should know that sickness should not stay in your body. It is what? Broken for you. In the name of God the Father, and God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Now, the Bible says, after he has done that, he took the cup. This is the blood of the new testament. This is the blood that Jesus shed for us. Listen. In your body right now, whatever is not of God is living now. Amen. That sickness is living now. Amen. That infection is living now. Amen. That pain is living now. Amen. Pain in your bone is living now. Amen. Pain in your eyes is living now. Amen. Yes, I, those of us who are here having issues with eyes, 2020 vision is coming now. Amen. There's restoration of sight now. Amen. Spiritual and physical. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. there's restoration coming now. Amen. There's a creative miracle happening now. Yeah. There's creative miracle happening now. Yeah. Marriages are being restored now. Yeah. Home are being rebuilt now. Yeah. Every problem in your life, the Lord is fixing now. Yeah. I said the Lord is fixing now. Yeah. Whatever has not answered to you in life will begin to answer now. Yeah. We drink this in the name of God the Father yeah. and God the Son yeah. and God the Holy Spirit. Some of you are going to have dreams this night that will make you beat the devil blue black till he die. This is the kind of night that they say, and Satan died. Some of you will get angry in your subconscious and finish up the enemy that has stood against your life. And Satan died. You will just be oiled by your
yourself and you put it, you can put it on your head, you can put it on your hand. In fact, you can put it on your leg. Because you see this your legs. Eh? It will carry you to a place of destiny soon. Mm. Destiny helper is about to jam you on the road. You understand what I mean? We didn't prepare for it. Eh? We are just going on our own and the person met me. I said, you need help? Come, follow me. It's, it's happening to somebody now. I said, it's happening to you now. If you don't believe in the power of God, don't come around our ministry. We have seen too much miracle to doubt God. Too much. Say, who is destiny helper? Say, who is destiny helper? Where is the destiny helper? I said, you are meeting your destiny helper now. In the name of Jesus. Father, as the rod was in the hand of Moses and the mantle of Elijah in the hand of Elisha. So, is this oil in our hand? It becomes a, the oil of fire. Amen. Everyone that touches this oil and anoints themselves with this oil, a strange order of breakthrough is happening now. Thank you, Father. Jesus' precious name. Hallelujah. Let your Holy Spirit come and take control of every situation that has troubled my mind. All my cares and burdens unto you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, precious name. Amen. Now, now, after this prophetic week, it is important that you take out an offering and give to the Lord. Is it okay? Both online and offline. Those of you online, just use your oil and anoint yourself. I'm sure you have followed up on this we are doing here. The Lord bless you. Now, take an offering. Take an offering. Take an offering. Take an offering quickly, quickly, quickly. Take an offering. It's, a, it's an offering of sacrifice to say thank you to the Lord for these five days of breakthrough. Hallelujah. Now, those of you online, you can give, you know, to uh, the ministry account. Uh, please, can somebody put that online for us? Or you just add it to the group or send it to the group, send it to the group. And just take an offering. Hallelujah. Rise up with your offering. Rise up with your offering. Rise up with your offering. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want you to lift it up. 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 I want to, are you, are we ready? I want, please, let's be fast. I want to, I want us to be on our way home. I want us to be on our way home now. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Now, a very wealthy man, I heard this testimony from one of our dear fathers in the faith, a very wealthy man, went to the Lord and said, I have not given you enough. Now, this is why. He said, because you have not tested me with money. <laughs> so, he wrote a check and he said, you, try me. Give me this money. I'll tell you how much I can give you. He's talking to God. <laughs> and something strange happened. You know, the Lord wants to also see your heart, whether you really if, you, if money comes to your hand today, whether you will, you will remember it. And so the Lord supplied the money. And, and he gave all. Now, let me tell you the implication of what he did. The following week, the Lord met him in a dream and said, you beat me to it. He said, tell me, how much do you want now? Let's try it again. Guess what? From that day, he says the, the Lord will appear to him and say, how much should we play with? So they've been playing with money. A man like you, a man of like passion like you, has been, he will say, Father, oh yeah, let's try now. Let's try. There's a project going on in so-so place. You put, bring the money and see, we'll finish that project in one month. And he has been doing that. He goes around looking for 
where something is happening with the people of God. And he will say, God, bring it. I'll give them. Bring it. I'll give them. He has made himself a reservoir where the work of God will continue on the earth. Lift up that thing. Somebody is going to lift up that offering today. This is what is going to happen to you. This is what is going to happen to you. Eh? From that offering, you and the Lord will begin to do transaction from today. I know some people will not believe it. I said you will begin to do transaction. Yeah, you will begin to do transaction. Father, you give me one billion. Come and see what I will do. Uh, Father, give me two billion, two billion. And see what I will do. See, we, 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 you will see how many people will be taken out of hospitals. People who are holding money in the hospital. You will see how many people will be healed. How many people will be saved. How many villages will be delivered for God. I want to pray for you. As you give tonight, that's your portion. I said, that is your portion. That is your portion. You will not borrow. You will give to nations. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Jesus, precious name. Give your offering joyfully. God bless you. God bless you, Pastor Mike. I think you should just take over from here. Let's close now. The Lord bless you. Thank you so much, everyone, for coming. God bless you. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. If you know you have been blessed tonight, just put your hands together for Jesus, for Jesus, for Jesus. Praise God. You can have your seats briefly. We'll be out of here in the next five minutes. I just want you to raise, out, raise up a war cry on behalf of Pastor Yomiya San. Say, Father, even as you have used your son, this well, this well spring of water will never run dry. The Bible says, he that water shall be watered also. The Libra soul shall be made fat. Let's pray that God will make this soul fat. In the name of Jesus, the hand of the Lord will be perpetually upon him. It will never be said once upon a time. No, 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 no. It shall be from glory to glory. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. The Lord began to lay upon our hearts some time ago, some days ago, and I believe you must have heard it on ignition. Um, the Lord laid upon our hearts that we raise partners to stand as pillars in the house of God as we pray and lift men up to God. And so we have a strata that was arranged for people who want to come into partnership with God. And we are very careful to make it known to the world that we are not asking for people who will just be bringing money. No, we are not money-centric, but we are finance-centric because the work of God cannot be done without money. And so we raised up some groups of people, those who said, oh, we would like to be, uh, you know, partners to the tune of 10,000. We would like to be partners to the tune of 50, 100, 500, 1 million. If you want 10 million, no problem. If you want 1 billion, no problem per month. Partners who will stand with God in this place to raise up a generation of people that God has called us to raise. And we've been having turnouts and I want to throw it out to us again. Perchance you want to partner with Soul Lives Global and Zion Tribe to say for the work that God is doing, this is what I want to commit myself to every month. I, oh, I, Pastor Yomi, I want to do this 10,000. I want to do 20. I want to do 50. I want to do 100, I want to do 500, I want to do 200, whatever, whatever, whatever God is laying upon your heart. Please feel free to meet any of our ushers and they will link you to the platform and send you the partner's form. You will just fill it online on Google and send back and that will be that. And the Lord, the Lord God, the one who ordered that step will bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you for coming. We celebrate the grace of God upon your life and we know that God who has called you is able to do much more than what you ask or imagine. Hallelujah. I, I, sorry, I'm interrupting Pastor Mike. Today is, um, um, as he told me, a Darius birthday and I'm telling you she's been a pillar in this work. She's been very supportive from the first day. She doesn't want to be announced. If not, you will have seen her face on all the platforms since morning. She does not like to be announced, but I'm going to announce her regardless. Somebody, can we celebrate her? Let's rise to our feet. 
Happy birthday to you. Bring the cake, bring the cake. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. See the beautiful cake. Carry it for her now. Happy uh -huh. birthday. Bless you. May the good Lord bless you. May the good Lord bless you now. May the good Lord bless you. Hallelujah. Can you please stretch forth your hand and just say something beautiful? It's a new year for her, and I feel that this is a new beginning for her. Yes, it's a new beginning of prosperity. It's a new beginning of progress. It's a new beginning of advancement. It's a new beginning of help. It's a new beginning of favor. It's a new beginning of fruitfulness. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, she is breaking into limelight. Yes, she's breaking forth. She's shining forth. Something new is going to begin to happen in her life. In case people have written her off, they are about to see the new hour. Yes, they are about to see the new hour. Because what they thought will never be possible will begin to come now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the, the whole world is about to gather together to celebrate this woman of God. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Christ. The Lord remember our labor. The Lord remember our labor of love and reward that accordingly. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you Father. In Jesus precious name we are prayed. Amen. Ma, I'm just saying that this is a new beginning. Yes, it's a new beginning. I agree together with you by faith that this is a new beginning. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You are rising from here into new things. You are rising from here into new things. I'm seeing a enlargement on your case. I'm seeing enlargement. This is not the first time I'm seeing enlargement on your matter. But this time around is an enlargement in multiple folds. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name, we have prayed. Amen. Hallelujah. Happy birthday, man. We celebrate you. We love you. We honor you. Thank you so much for your sacrifice to this house. Thank you so, so much. God bless you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. All right, let's share the grace of God together. Hallelujah. Are you ready? Say, the Lord God is my strength and shield. Say it convincingly. Say, the Lord God is my strength and shield. The Lord will give me grace and glory. No good thing will you withhold from me as I walk uprightly. Now, turn to someone and say, surely. And uh -uh, say it well now. God's goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life. And you shall dwell in God's presence forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. Amen. Shout hallelujah. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you.